Looking at this much more clear angiogram, you can identify a few important structures. Starting by vertebral artery on both sides, as you can see here, joining together to form the basilar artery, and then this will continue and form at the end two terminal branches that are the posterior cerebral artery, as you can see here. Just below posterior cerebral artery, you can find the superior cerebellar artery. If you remember, in between them, there is the origin of the third cranial nerve just in between. And a much clearer one with a 3D construction of the same image starting from the beginning. This is vertebral artery, vertebral artery, that's basal artery. Of course, this one with a C shape is the internal cord artery terminating into metacerebral artery and anterior cerebral artery going forward. And this is a very nice. And the main finding here that the basal artery is occluded, as you can see here, in the middle. Circular fill is very clear with the basal artery occlusion.